Arizona Attorney General Mark Brnovich is asking the FBI and the Department of Justice to investigate the now former president of the Scottsdale School Board at the center of controversy. Fox 10's Nicole Garcia has been following this story for several days. She joins us live with an update. Hi, Nicole. Good evening, guys. Even more fallout for Jan Michael Greenberg, who was ousted from his role as Scottsdale School Board President earlier this week. This after the discovery of a Google Drive linked to him containing hundreds of files of personal and sensitive information on parents who've been outspoken against school board policies. Abuse of position and power, possible violation of parents' constitutional rights are a couple of issues that Attorney General Mark Brnovich mentions in his letter to the FBI. Asking if there's possible violations of you know, federal privacy laws, and instead of Merrick Garland focusing on parents being domestic terrorism, as the FBI called them, they should be focusing on government bodies like school boards that are trying to intimidate parents. Jan Michael Greenberg was ousted as Scottsdale School Board president and has ignored calls for his resignation. Even if he resigns, if there was a use of possible misuse of public money, that's a serious problem. There appear to be bad actors involved, and I am confident our law enforcement professionals will quickly resolve these issues. While Greenberg awaits the results of the Scottsdale police investigation, Brnovich is trying to take this case to a higher level. The rule of law has to mean something. And no matter who you are, what your position is, you can't intimidate or keep dossiers on your opponents. I mean, it's just very anti-American and it's, I think, against everything we stand for. No one should ever be intimidated or be in fear for exercising their First Amendment rights and no parent ever, ever should be afraid to speak out at a school board meeting. And the Scottsdale Unified School District is launching its own investigation. It plans to hire a forensic investigator to see if any school or public resources were used in the creation of this dossier. Reporting live, I'm Nicole Garcia, Fox 10 News.